is up guys, Equirus here, and today we're going to talk about 5 rare tetras you've probably never seen. To start off with the bang, we got the Sailfin Tetra. Now I know most, if not all of you guys, even knew this existed. This fish has a very unique shape and can raise some eyebrows for Aquarius with a distinguished eye. This fish, like all other fish in this video, is found in South America and requires slightly acidic water to thrive in. Other than that, they don't seem to have any special requirements. Our next tetra is called the Red Lion Lizard Tetra. These fish have a particularly long body and have a red line extending from their nose to their tail. They're kind of hard to find, so if you do find one, consider yourself lucky. The red line lizard tetra acts like any other tetra and prefers a slow moving water. This fish is a cool little oddball and definitely on my wish list. Our third rare tetra is called the Elios tetra, which kind of looks like the Colombian tetra's long lost cousin. However, they only end up getting to a max size of around an inch, which is around half the max size of the Colombian tetra, which is 2 to 3 inches. If you ever end up keeping this species, try using dark substrates to make their colors more defined and vibrant. Our fourth tetra is the killifish looking rainbow capella tetra. This fish is one of the harder tetras to find, but are very easy to keep. They have an elongated pink body, which is not something you see every day. Pink is one of the rarer colors in the hobby, so this fish can complete the rainbow if you ever get your hands on it. You, you, you see what I did there? Oh, all right. And last but not least is the Toucan Tetra, characterized by the long black stripe and red cheek. Though, I'd admit, this is one of the more basic Tetras. The black and red contrast makes this fish a great addition to any planted tank. If you're able to get them to color up, they'll have a striking gold body which is just icing on the cake. But be wary, this fish's max size is under an inch, so make sure it's kept with other nano fish. And with that said, that is five rare tetras. Now if you want a part two, um, well, I'll just make another one, I guess. Like anyways, whether you like it or not. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in a bit.